spray, and I bet you've got some at home. There's a lot of things you can use it for besides just your hair. And I totally recommend the cheapest hairspray you can find if you're going to use it very often. If you have oil, olive oil, salad dressing on clothes, spray a heavy coat of hairspray on it. Let it soak in. Then you're going to go back and you're just going to take some talcum powder, cornstarch, anything like that. You're going to sprinkle it on and I always work it in a little because you want it to absorb that oil. Once it absorbs the oil, you can launder as usual and the oil will be gone. So great use for hairspray. Now, if you have labels on things that you want to get off, easy way to do it. Spray hairspray on, and you're going to let them soak for a little while. It makes it easier that way. And I use these little scrapers that I found on Amazon to lift tags and things off. Then you're just going to kind of get under it. Well, it's going to come up pretty good right now. You're just going to get under that and lift it up, and it comes right off. It's the alcohol in that hairspray that does it. Now, hair color. You know, I always tell you hair color should be naked in the backyard, but of course we can't do that. So instead, we want to keep hairspray handy when we're coloring our hair. If we spill it, the first thing we're going to do is put a really heavy coat of hairspray on it and see how it starts to dissolve that so that you can launder it and get that immediately out of there. But remember, it has to be really quickly done. Otherwise, there's no hope. Now, if you have ink on clothes, maybe even a pen went through the washer or the dryer, hairspray can be your friend. You're going to take the hairspray again. You're going to spray a really heavy coat on, and I'm going to let that sit. Well, that's some hairspray. And then you're going to work it in and then launder it as usual. And again, it's that alcohol in the hairspray that will take it out. Now, maybe you put your jeans on one morning and the zipper doesn't want to stay up. What do you do? Take some hairspray, spray the zipper, zip them up, spray it again. The tackiness of the hairspray will keep that zipper from sliding down. And last but not least, pet hair, lint, anything that you want to get off of pillows or any surface. Maybe the cats have been on the couch. You're going to spray that hairspray onto it. I use a paper towel because then you can throw it out when you're done. But you're just going to rub it over that just like this to gather that all up. And you see how I'm gathering it up? and it's forming its little balls of hair on my paper towel. The stickiness in the hairspray is what takes that off. Now, if you're looking for a printable copy of everything, go to queenofclean.com. Check me out at Facebook at Real Queen of Clean and Real Queen of Clean on Instagram. Hey, guys, thanks for talking dirty with the Queen of Clean.